Perfect. Perfect. Overseas operator. Yes, I'd like to make a collect call to Le Banque Genève. A Mr. Ivan Hessman. Cecile de Poulignac. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Ivan, darling. Yes. Is everything ready? Wonderful. All right, I've made arrangements to make the deposit in Bay City tonight and get the certified check. Now, certified checks are still good as cash these days, right? Wonderful. All right, Ivan, um, I will be there first thing tomorrow morning. Thank you so much for everything. Vida Zane. my question or what? I haven't lost anything except a little more innocence. Whatever that means. I really thought I had seen everything. Do you want to translate, please? I'm in a hurry here. I've actually kind of gotten used to the idea of you and Cass together. I mean, I figure he's a jerk, you're a bigger jerk. Am I going to have to call security? This ain't the palace, princess. In case you haven't noticed, there is no security. How long before Cass finds out? What are you blabbering about? It's a pretty neat plan. Rotten, but clever, I do have to say. All right, that's it. I am calling the police. I don't think Cass would be too pleased to know a former employee that has been rifling through his desk. You're no amateur, are you? You're a real pro. What are you talking about? Take the money and run. What money? The Mackenzie Corey Scholarship Fund. <laughs> it's pretty low, Your Highness. <laughs> Obviously. You're so lovesick for Cass, you're prepared to say anything. If you go now, I won't call the cops. I'm going, but apparently not as far as you are. Where to, by the way? Monaco? Reno? Pango Pango? Switzerland, actually. <laughs> of course. Neutral territory. How silly of me. How could... It, it's a doctor's appointment, a very important doctor's appointment. But I will be back in time for an intimate dinner for two Sunday night. Oh, come off it, Cecile. You're a liar and a fraud, and worst of all, you have taken that poor sap's heart out once again and stomped all over it with your stilettos. Oh, spare me the imagery. You are caught, Cecile. And I am shaking in my slippers. Nancy Drew discovers an airline ticket. Big deal. Is this how you intend to win Cass back? By running to him with this cockamamie theory? No. No way. I have already ruined his life once by telling him more than he wanted to know. I'm not going through that again. Oh, good thinking. At least poor Nicole was just crazy. You're a trash, Cecile. I don't really care what you think. Now, if you're not leaving, I will. Look, for some strange reason, Winthrop wants you. And for some even stranger reason, I think the poor guy deserves at least half a chance of being happy. So? So, I'm going to give you a chance to be a human being. You leave the money alone, and I won't tell anyone. Frankie, what are you doing here? Losing my appetite. 